And now to a heart-stopping moment caught on camera. Watch this video. A three-year-old boy nearly choking to death on a piece of candy as his mother desperately tries to get him help. And there is a happy ending thanks to a police officer who arrived just in the nick of time. ABC's David Wright is with us with the story. And good morning to you, David. Good morning, Lara. You know, there's been so much talk about police body cameras these past few months. Well, those th th these are the little cameras that police wear on their chests. This amazing scene was captured on one of those cameras. And the amazing thing is the officer didn't even hit the record button. A three-year-old boy on, upside buddy. down on a police officer's oh. knee and choking you to okay? death accidentally turns on the officer's body camera as the officer struggles to save him. 911, what is the address of your emergency? This is Ray uh, calling the um, Green Valley Groceries 24. I need yes, what's going on? Paramedic. It was the cashier at Green Valley Groceries, Ray Sanchez, who first called 911 after two panicked parents rushed into his store in Mesquite, Nevada with their son. This lady is coming in with a, a child. Is he choking? Yes, he's choking. It was just scary. Little Damien Valencia was semi-conscious, choking on a candy, a jawbreaker the size of a quarter, like this one, that he got at a birthday party. Off-duty police officer Quinn Averitt was less than a block away when he got the call. I took the child from the father. I turned him upside down over my knee and began a reverse Heimlich maneuver. Come on, buddy. The body camera footage captures okay. the moment the officer saves him. Oh. You okay? You may not be able to see the jawbreaker pop out, but you can hear the relief. Is he breathing? Is he breathing? He's, he's breathing. <laughs> Days later, at the police station, an emotional reunion. When I saw him, I just started crying. Damien's family got to thank the man who saved their little boy's life. She cried, I cried a little bit because it really touched me because I have children of my own. Another reunion is set for next month. That's when the Mesquite Police Department and City Council will honor the officer with a life-saving award. Damien, his brother, and their parents all will be there. It was a good ending, you know, a happy ending that my son's still with me. After the police officer stabilized the boy, the paramedics arrived and they determined the boy didn't have to be hospitalized. And the police department there only got these body cameras a few weeks ago, like so many other police departments in response to Ferguson. And little did they know that it would capture a scene like this. Capturing wow. a scene of just great thinking. What a nice story, great ending. Thank you, David. Sure.